What's up guys, Matco Michael just pulled up, so let's go take a look, see what he's got on the truck today. You guys, come on. Loading this one here today for me. Uh, if we sell the other seven sets today, yeah, we're we're unloading. So, what's the policy on buying the rest of them, and when I win it, giving them back? Uh, getting a <laughs> refund. <laughs> yeah, getting a refund. That's a no go. <laughs> oh, I forgot. I asked. That's a no go. I tell you what, I would do. Let's say it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven sets you got, right? Yeah. Bill, you buy one. I might. Yep. We'll see what would happen. I'd buy the other six. That put me seven names in there and I still wouldn't win it there in the box. Talk about heartbreak. That would be... Uh, would be like, here, Merry Christmas. I got you some. My mom would be like, oh, those were nice. Thank you. <laughs> Give everybody a set of Matco screwdrivers for Christmas. Hey, that's alright. That's perfect off good. Or Woo! I'd buy all the rest of them. I knew I could end up with that car. That'd be really nice. Well, Bill what you really. got new this week? Well, Bill's already picked it up once. So they got some new knives out. Pro knife, yeah. Pro knife, shit, I can't use them. Well, I'm gonna tell you what, they're, professional they're, uh, they're pretty Money sharp. butchers. Well, okay. it's for cutting like trim, and I've even had one guy say that he used it for, he does an interior for like headliners and stuff. I don't know. We can't let Wally have anything like that. Well, can't. there's some customers that I didn't really want to show because, I mean, it just works just right, you know, and I'm like, hey, it's high temper already, you know. But, Prison change. I mean, <laughs> I don't know. Wally, if these get sold, I would watch clear if you start leaving Clay's tools on the floor again. That's, yeah, that's, that's a good point. That's a gut knife, man. it, Clay? Oh, yeah. I think that's what they used on me. Catch you right there in the college. <laughs> We'll fix you, Wally. There won't be no more Wallys running around. <laughs> a, or no. Wally Yips. Hey, that's what we need to do to Bill. Mm. <laughs> no. Won't be no Bellinas running around here no more. <laughs> Bellettas. Bill said no. So what's the price on the three-piece pro knife set? Yeah, that's, that's pretty nice. Bill, if you ever have to go to prison, I get we. I'm gonna hide something like that. 129. 129. Yeah, man, there's people in there making them with toothbrushes, and you're gonna come in with style. <laughs> yeah. It's gonna hurt when you go to Keister, that joker, though. I put the coin in <laughs> down. <laughs> you must stab yourself trying to get it out. I put the point in down, and that way, if uh, anybody ever wanted to check you, they'd, they'd find out real quick. They didn't like it. I think I'm out of that conversation. I am out. I don't want to be in what you got back here? That is, well, I'll come back here and set that chair up. Mm -hmm. There, more like an umbrella to me. No, that's not an umbrella. I had a customer buy that, and I've been showing it off all week, of course, with his permission. But, uh. What was it like a. Like a cap or something? Holy crap! Holy oh, shoot, what a chair. That'll make you feel like a little kid, won't it, Wally? Mm hmm. So it comes with some footballs that you can throw. It, it can be a chair or a game, but just basically a big chair. I mean, how cool is that? Well, it's pretty cool. And I know it's freaking huge. It's comical. But it's gonna make you feel like a little boy sitting in that thing. On. I told my wife, I said, I'm just gonna start taking it to the ball games. And no, they like, don't sit in it. When somebody don't sits do. in front of me intentionally, I, I'm just like, get it fine, out. <laughs> I wanna be a big kid in that one. That's pretty cool right there. That's the biggest chair I've ever seen in my life. Hey, no joke. Wally. Will it hold my fat self on it? Yeah. What are you talking? Yeah. Hop up in there, Wally, and let's try it on. I'm afraid I'll scratch something. If Michael don't mind, I will. I break the chair. Try it on, Wally. You good, Michael? Try What's the weight limit uh -huh. on it, Wally? <laughs> I don't know. We're going to find out. Oh. That's actually not that bad. Bill, this is your size chair. <laughs> that is so funny. Yeah, his little feet don't even touch. <laughs> Michael, can I ride with you the rest of the day? Uh, <laughs> that air conditioner's blowing right on me, man. Yeah, 
Yeah, that is. Hey, good. that's about all he's going to do hey, all day. I can sell right. tools for you. First red light I come to, I do a brake <laughs> check and throw them off on the floor. <laughs> that's Dirty. Right there. Man, they said brake check, man. Yep. Uh, we take care of Wally longer. around here. I'm proud you got one of them right there because them are the best things you can spend your money on. Tire steps? Mm hmm. Yeah, I, uh, I keep them on stock. Those are worth every penny, whatever hey, it costs. They go pretty quick. Hey, can you get these other than camo? Uh, I will check and see. That Wally. one was in the flyer. Wally? He wants a pink one. <laughs> That's what I just said. say. You got another new light? Yeah, you know I like lights. Mm -hmm. I think they do. But. This is one of their new ones here. So, collapsible, foldable light. That's going to be the part over there with 800 lumens. It's got two strong magnets on there, so it can be held up. Pretty nice light. Needless to say, if I'm ever stranded in a blackout, I'm going to be okay. All I got to do is go to the tool truck. I've got enough lights to last me at least a week. That's right. So what's uh, Matt Coe's best under hood light that y'all have? Uh, let me get the book out. I've sold a couple. Because we've got the snap-on ones, but they eat the batteries like really quick. Really fast. So one of the ones that I sell the most is this convertible hood light here. So that actually, it has a battery that it can run off of, but if the battery does run down, it's got a, a cable to go with it. It's a 25 foot cable, so okay. it can run off that or the cable. Um, that's the one I sell the most of. And that one, it swivels on um, like yeah. on there, right? Yeah, the, the ends swivel. So How many lumens is that one? Uh, it says 600 on low and on high it's 1170. And it can charge while the light is on. So if you are having to use the light with the cord because it's ran down while well, it's steadily charging while you're yeah. using it. So So how long is the battery supposed to last sometimes? Uh let me look and see. I know I had one on a truck on low all day, but as soon as I say that I'll And what's the price of that jumper? We need a good one, don't we, Wally? Yes. We're all blind. Light challenged is more like it, ain't it, Bill? That's right. Is that same set just pin different? Mm -hmm. I prefer them. I do too, Wally. Like you sent the new quick release ones up there? Mm -hmm. They got a little red. He's probably got some up there on the ceiling. They have a little red ring it goes around them and you can push it up without having to mash the button. You got any up there, Bill? Uh-uh. Yeah, here's one. Alright, Wally, check this out. Here's one. You can let it down by mashing the button when you get ready to go up. See how it does it? You don't have to mash the button. Like it won't go back down, but you don't have to mash the button to get it to go up. That's hard to do with my hand in the See there? No. Oh, I see. That's pretty cool. There's pivots off in there. Something about them teeth, they just bite and won't let go. Well, they're Wally approved too, because they yeah. survive. <laughs> if they'll make it three months with Wally, they'll make it a lifetime with their <laughs> 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 Alright, so what's the scoop on the hood light? The hood light runs 259. Uh, I don't know if I remembered it wrong or what, but it says it runs 
two hours on low and an hour on high. I could have swore it run longer than that on the truck, but I may be. Right. But I used to have, I don't know if you remember me having it hanging up up there or not. Had it on zip ties. All right, so we priced this one last week on the snap on the truck. So what's your price? Let's see. The little baby. Y'all remember what he priced me the little bitty one for last week? Let's see if Michael can beat the price. I can't believe you're putting that back, Wally. Much as you love nipping it. Wally likes it. So. Pretty crazy, like as much as he likes not putting stuff back up. Oh yeah, <laughs> true. That's true, Bill. Actually, look, Michael's gonna restock just for you. I did. Look at all the new keychains up there. Tons of keychains. So I don't know what other dealers sell these for in Maco. So if, if you've been looking at these on another Maco truck and it's higher, it's just that distributor. I sell them a little lower. Um, I try to stay around 75 on them. Okay. Now, other dealers could be higher. Um, I don't sell a whole lot of them, so mm -hmm. I don't try to make a whole lot of them off of them these. Um, but. All right. You selling the parent jaw ones? I've sold one set. Um, other than that, I haven't sold a whole lot of those. Well, he did good. He put it back. He just put it in the wrong spot. <laughs> it did. I'll it over I'll here. I put it in two to see how much it took to aggravate you. I'll just move it. Testing out his OCD, huh? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I, I like those too. Ladies. I put them on my service truck. You've been wanting one man right there, Bill. Didn't need that. Well, we actually ended up getting one. But is this what you were talking about the other week? Yeah. It's... Toyota has a really nice cap one style design. Yeah, that's the one we ended up with was the cap one. Yeah, it, it works well. Little, little grooves cut in it. What do you think, Bill? Mm -hmm. I like how thin the head is. Yeah, it's tiny. Yeah, that's what I was talking about a little while ago. I'd rather take that long snap on in, which is similar to this, I think. I think it's straight head. For one like that, for one short one. It's a little old bitty thing, one, Joker. She was going to talk to Michael about it after we went on Joe's truck the other day. He said you're going to have to talk to Michael. Because this is what oh, yeah. I just got because it was uh, a free candy. Have you ever been on Joe's truck? No. Yes. You can watch the video? I did. It's a bag of tray full of actual snacks. Like Doritos and so here's the thing, Joe. You talking about Joe? Oh, you're talking about Joe Gonzalez. Yes. Yeah. So here's the thing about that, and I was actually gonna bring that up. <laughs> um, we went over. I went over there. Yes, I've been on his truck. I went over there Friday night, or maybe it was Thursday night. I can't. No, it was Thursday night. Um, and I saw that he had him in a. Well, he had him in a toolbox at one mm -hmm. time. I don't know what he had it at. And I really liked that idea. Well, then we went to our district meeting and we got on the subject of sodas. Uh, one guy has sodas on his truck where he has a cooler and he puts like Cokes and Sprites and stuff like that in it and he lets his techs get those, you know, one per tech free. So what I actually was going to do is I want to poll from the, the viewers on here, would you rather have snacks or drinks? And I'm going to start doing something. Um, so yeah, I've got candy, but would you rather have a bag of Doritos or a Coke, right? Yeah. And I want to put water in there too because it's coming up on the hot side. So, and I may end up doing both. I don't know, but yeah, we that's something that we're wanting to do. Um, we've got a cooler ordered, a Yeti micro cooler. So I don't know yet. I'm gonna try to sell it or I'm gonna put drinks in it and give, we'll give the drinks away. Yeah, man, and Wally both opened that drawer and was like, "What? Look at this!" Yeah, he, yeah, he. Uh, now the funny story about Joe is Joe actually hired me for my last job. He, uh, I guess now it's been nine years ago, he hired me as a 
parts driver. So he's he's really good at what he does. He was a parts manager. So he knows his he knows his inventory in and out. He knows all the little he had his pick and span. Yeah, good. man, he, he, he's good at that. He's good at that. Well, you didn't get bills. High bills. Well, colors. actually, I did. I just pulled to the side because there were the they were. I was about to get disappointed there for a minute. No. Right. So now here is where the bullshit stops, Bill. So here's the thing. They were one of the best selling. So when it would come to the last one, I'm going to have to pull them off. He was thinking of you. So I wanted you to at least have the opportunity. There's no pressure. I just want to do that off. Let him just look at them and hold them a well, minute. I appreciate it. <laughs> no, I ain't. No, put, put them back over from here. <laughs> That's, that's, that's a good man right there. Hurt I, no, I'm going to hurt your feelings if you don't leave me alone. <laughs> so, no, there's no pressure. Uh, I just, I wanted you to have the opportunity. You said if I got one set in, and I got them in Monday. I, and thought, I, I thought I was going to get them Friday evening, but I got them Monday, so. Which I wasn't here Monday. I had to take my daddy to Memphis. But, yeah. man, I, I weren't wondering about that all week long. I wanted it to be a surprise today. You saw I had a head over here. He, he, said, he said, I'll wait when I close my eyes. All I could think about was that big old black Metco box. <laughs> we told him he should have picked it up last Friday. <clears throat> Don't listen. You know, you snooze, you lose sometimes, right. Bill. You see how quick it took me back my mind up. I want to get in on that. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Yeah, Michael said, <laughs> I think this is how it kind of went. Michael said, yeah, you buy a set of those screwdrivers, you win that box. I think I just did like that. <laughs> yeah. like it, yeah, was that, that was quick. it was that quick. Buy a set of screwdrivers, you entered in a chance. Clay had his set up here real quick. Like That's a really nice box right there. That thing would look amazing in our shop. We shop. Whether I win it or Wally wins it, since Bill <laughs> ain't in the drawing. <laughs> the day ain't over yet, brother. <laughs> Michael didn't be, uh, Michael didn't be gone. Bill's gonna text me. Hey, go ahead and lay me out one of the screwdrivers. I'm gonna go ahead and get it. <laughs> he held out on me. I'm gonna hold out on him. Make him, make him sweat it for a minute. Hey, he ain't sweating. What are you talking about? I got, I got. I noticed you got the screwdriver laying up there, Bill. Yeah. You two box stand, huh? Yep. Yeah. Maybe it'll be mine. Well, we got three out of 20 chances to bring it in the shop. That's better than everybody else, right? That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks for watching this video. Hopefully, we will win the big black toolbox. Anyway, you guys have a great one. Like always, hit that thumbs up and click that subscribe button. Why, Wally? It's totally free. It don't cost them a dime. It never cost y'all a dime. If you guys want one of these awesome diesel medic t shirts, there's a link down below. Go to Teespring, pick you up one, and that way you will look as awesome as Wally. You may not perform as good as Wally, oh, God. but you'll look as good as Wally. You guys have a great one. Catch you next time.